Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Windows 10 login screen is not appearing or password option field is not showing up on your Windows 10 device. So it should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So there's going to be a few different methods I'm going to go over in today's tutorial. So let's just say you have your lock screen here and you don't see your password. All you have to do is perhaps just drag your mouse down. So just if you hold down your mouse cursor and just slide it up, you notice now you have the ability to sign into your account. Another thing you can try if you're unable to see this, or perhaps you know it just goes back to a blank background screen for the lock screen, you can try tapping the Control Alt Delete keys on your keyboard at the same time. So again, Control Alt Delete at the same time. You might also just tap on Control Alt Delete, and now you see we have options here to switch user, to sign out, to lock this computer as well. So it gives you additional options as well. So you can always try switching the user and then hopefully then you would be able to have access to user accounts listed here as you can see on my screen so just giving you guys another option there so let's say you're able to sign in to your computer but you're having some kind of issue you can also try running a system restore so if you open up the start menu and you type in system restore you might already have some restore points on your computer if system protection is on and if you select the system restore button and you select next, there should be restore points available on this listing here that you can go back and restore your computer to. So pretty straightforward process there, just wanted to give you guys another option that could potentially resolve your issue. Another thing you could try doing would be to open up the star menu, type in N-E-T-P-L-W-I-Z. You want to go ahead and run that command, so just go ahead and left click on that. So it might say users must enter a user password to use this computer. You can keep that check marked or unchecked marked. I mean, it really depends on what you want to do there. So you might be able to find some success by modifying this here. So you can go ahead and actually just change that. So you just want to sign it automatically. Just go ahead and uncheck the box. And you'd have to go ahead and enter in your current password. And you'd have to confirm the password. I don't have a password on this administrative account, so I just leave it blank. But just to give you guys an idea. So just bring another potential fix out there for you. And as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.